I know, chat, I know. We're like one minute late and the world is going under. If only I joined the server one minute earlier, then I could have stopped humanity's downfall, but now it's over. It's over, I'm one minute late. I don't know if, uh, guys, it's been a good one, but yeah, we're, we're late for the cup. Humanity hinged on me being on the server in time. <laughs> okay. This should work. Um, thank you guys for the primes though, Jerome. Oh, this looks nice. Enjoy your life. Clone it, thank you. Retro, thank you. We're on the server. In time. Is this? So this guy, I've had some of his maps and like random map challenges and stuff. I actually really like Blade Runner maps. Often because they're pretty open. Pretty open area maps. So high speed. Ooh, this is intense. Does anyone know if there is a piece of hardware to change different audio's outputs? EA turning only knob to change music, one for game sounds, etc. Uh, that would be a, a mixer called like Go XLR, for example. This guy so that one is discontinued, so you gotta find something I've else. But been wanting to make merch people would like. Ooh. I for one would love some shower socks merch. <laughs> oh my god, he's back. The shower sock man. <laughs> Rowan, thank you for the 22 months. That's like one break tap in the start. That's one break tap too. There's like this three very me. small drifts Dude. already, I can tell. And then this was a lot of full speed, right? Just, oh, that's not anymore because I'm faster. So small drift there. But if you can, you should full speed through the mountains and then... I can even speed slide on a speed tech map. That's fun. Okay. Just getting familiar. This looks like a very old school track of the day. Is what it reminds me of. Like track of the days from 2020 used to look like this. And you can probably jump directly into the finish. Okay. So one small drift tap here. To give you one small drift tap here. To give you one small drift tap here. Or release, I'm not sure. Full speed this. That's also full speed. This is now a small drift tap. Uh, okay, so this is like a, <laughs> a question that will appear a lot if you play high speed maps in Trek Mania. And if you check anyone else's VODs of this too, they're gonna say the same thing. Is that a drift or is it a release? It is very hard to tell whether drifting is the best or releasing is the best on maps like this. It's very hard to tell. This guy, Sigma There's often dude. no like Imagine very clear you answer. Imagine what do in Punk Champs if you had plus 2,000 games of chess under your belt like some of the others. Right? Hope you get to attempt for upper bracket again. I hope next year I get invited back. Because I would love to. I would love to try again with more games. Because I think I think I understand the game of chess pretty well. I just make the beginner mistakes. I, I, that, that, that's that's what they've been saying to me, and they might say that to not hurt my feelings, but that's what I've heard. It's like I'm actually really good at the game, but I make beginner mistakes. So I hope so too. It could be it could be just like sugarcoating it a bit. When we were preparing for today's game, Anna just said, how do I put this? Um, with the black pieces, when you play this one move, your results tend to be a little worse than if you don't play this move. And it's a move I've played every time I've lost. <laughs> My coach was just like, yeah, you're, you tend to play a, a little bit less optimally when you play this move. I'm like, yeah, okay, thanks coach, yep. Yeah. Thank you for protecting my feelings. That's cool. I'm... I'm ready for today. I think I have something fun to play, chat. A really fun line. Versus, uh, Saikuno.
Good speed. And then this is the one I wanted to release, I think. And it is, it is a release. And then this one is a drift, I'm pretty sure. Okay, one second, that's fine. The Pura Cow? Can't, can't reveal my prep. Oh, is this just released now? Cause you, whoa, that makes a lot of sense. With a really good first drift, the second one's a release. <laughs> it's very, I think it's just situational. But what I see as the ideal is drift once here, and then you get a good line here and you don't need to do anything. But I've changed my line like five times in the start already. How this? Oh, okay. I understand now. I don't like that you can fall off there on the inside. Good luck. Thank you. Bad start. I'll continue. So I wanted to test this turn. Yeah, that makes so much sense. Ah. Uh, okay. Hi Wertie, will I have a TM Hello. skill issue? Got any tips so that I can get better quicker? Um, I recommend just... <laughs> driving faster. But no, I mean, it, it depends on what, really, like... I've done a bit of coaching... This Sigma is... Dude. Recently? Yeah. Uh, with... With both Anna Kramling and Nemsko, and... People struggle with different things. But I'm thinking of uploading those and probably making like generally more educational stuff. Because I think that's one thing Trackmania is lacking. Trackmania uh, educational content. So maybe I can, maybe some of the tutorials I make could help. Eventually make. Ooh, this looks good. That looks good and. I mean, like, that ending is hard, but I, yeah, hmm. Can you make a tutorial on gears? They are like magic to me. <laughs> yeah, gears are, but like you, they don't start to matter until like you're at a certain level already, I feel like. But yeah, that is one of the more cryptic things to understand the game. There's a bunch of other things to learn before that. Before you get to where gears matter. Oh, this was a good run and it's not crazy fast. Point 0.8, I mean 20th, okay. And then, you know... I gain like 500s per turn here. Yeah, I can see it. Okay. Wow, half a year subbed to my favorite streamer. Keep up the good work, Viet7. Oh, wow. Do you see how much speed you can get there? With a really crazy start. Thank you so much for the support, Trollo. Try my best to really focus on this chat so I don't drop to Div 2. You have six minutes. Let's go, Viet. Forty-seven oh four is actually mental, but it has to be this full speed line here. Forty-seven oh four is like, like my run was not bad. It was not at all bad with point eight. But if you get enough space, I think this works. Oh, it's just mental precise though. Or maybe not? No, this is gear 4. Now this is going to be slow. 
and then... Yeah, I need to prevent that. Is that possible? It is? Oh dear god. Loot is with a point nine now. 46.9. No. Wow, come on. I'm crashing out a lot. I don't like it. I'm gonna just full focus for this for a second. Cause I need one more improvement. I need to get to like 0.6 to get division one. So let me just lock in on that. Oh, <laughs> the start, dude. The start is everything. 0.8, wow. Start is so much of what I'm losing. That's crazy. Like, 0.7. I'm nine tenths behind. What? There, there's something I fundamentally do not understand here. That, that there could be one drift I'm missing. That one checkpoint turn could be a drift, like a small drift tap. The the rest feels so intuitive. Unless it's like full speed and jump to finish. But there, there's at least one line I'm missing. I need to check this. Man, I need to check this. More sense? No, it doesn't. Can I do this? Oh, I can. That's probably good. Wow. <sighs> Intense map. <laughs> that is Division 1, but not like super confident on this. The, the line on the start here, you only do this because you just get to the turn faster. Even though you get airtime. The rest is just full sand. And I think it's a no slide where I did a no slide. I think I, I, think I have the strats. They're just full sanding harder. And maybe jumping into the finish? That, that would be the one detail that I don't know. The rest seems like kind of forced. Oh, you can get such a- yeah, it's so like 0 0.3 here into like 0 0.1, 0 0.2. And then let's just see. 
early drift setup. Full send. Point two still. Point two. Yeah, no, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. You're two and a half seconds behind with the F? Yeah, it's so hard. It's so hard. Let's see what Ludas did. 0.7 is crazy. It's actually a crazy time. I'm not even close to that. Enjoy your life. Are you enjoying life, chat? It has textures? Oh god, it has textures. Okay. Those around it. Even the slides here. Yeah, but oh, how does he survive? I tried that and slid out. Oh, that rock's invisible now. Yeah, I'm gonna be real. I might just quickly install skid marks and get rid of this. Alright, I think I'm doing that. Skid marks. Apply, 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 apply. And I think I have to clean cash. Uh, oh, I don't know if I want to clean cash. Oh, wait. If it works, it works. If not, okay, whatever. Kofi and Toby, sixth sons, thank you guys. Appreciate it. Phil, thank you. Sai Toby, Cal Tappy, Trollo, Brainstone, I appreciate it. I'm glad we got Div 1. First time with you guys, good luck. Thank you so much, Nerf. Okay, let's see. Oh, nice. So the... I installed custom tech... Uh, skid marks now to not get the mod to load. Had I played the entire qualifier with the textures, I probably would be used to it, but now I'm just destined to crash if I don't. I don't know if I hate the line where I... drift a lot and then get the airtime. I don't think I hate it. And then the inside no slide that Ludus did was mental. But yeah, I don't think I dislike this that much. I actually think it's faster. Than what he did. And then he went here and then... Oh, wow. Wow. Okay, I can do 47.2. 47.2, I can do. Anything lower is crazy. Been a while, welcome back, interdicted. Your game crashed twice, can't load into the cup, rip best quality. Maybe if you're fast enough? But yeah, that's really unfortunate. Ooh. Just remember that like, it goes both ways. Sometimes your game will crash, Sometimes it will be someone else's. One of my best couple of the day results, a second place I have from ages ago, was a couple of the day where <laughs> everyone crashed. So like half the people couldn't join Div 1. Uh, so we started with like 32 people left. And then I think I... My game just, for whatever reason, didn't crash on that map. And, and I got to finals against Dexter and lost the final. But I still, you know... A really good results. <laughs> so, it, it can happen. Mime also has a couple of day win on record. Because the server crashed for literally everyone. Everyone on the server crashed. And then he was the quickest to find the join link to the server. So he opened a link to the server. On his web browser. And then because he could join the server that way, he just instantly got the win. <laughs> Just immediately won the couple today because no one else could join. Yeah, free win. So, um, you just gotta know what to do when you disconnect, play around it. It's an opportunity.
Ooh. I'm not gonna go for the craziest no slide there. I'm just gonna get decent speed. And then I'll be a happy driver. Dude, this last part is intense. Point six. That last part is really intense. Does it feel like all the grind becomes unnecessary when you could just play smart? All the grind if it becomes unnecessary? I don't know. I think, I think... Part of the fun is the grind, you know? It's working for something and then having it happen. If you just win from a disconnect or something, it's gonna feel hollow. Part of the thing that gives you purpose is if you put a lot of time into something and then get the payoff. Like studying for an exam and then getting an an, an S, you know, an, an, an ace. The highest grade. Or like practicing for a chess tournament and then not getting knocked out in the group stage. Like, imagine making a chess account, playing about 200 games of chess, studying openings, watching videos, and then you go into the chess tournament. And then you win it, that would fill you with a lot, <laughs> a lot of satisfaction. There's just some, some, some random examples I could think of that do not, not necessarily apply to my life situation. Imagine winning because your opponent lags when crossing the finish line? That would feel like a hollow victory. If it were me in that situation and my opponent lagged but actually won, I would consider them the winner. You know? That's just if it was me who was who actually got the win, I would give the win to my opponent. I of course can't put myself in that situation because it's never happened. But had it happened, I would probably do that. Did I touch? I did. <laughs> no, I didn't. Wow. <laughs> but I... Hit the rock. Okay, we're all good. People have already crashed. So just here, just zoom. And then... This map is actually pretty crash heavy, I think. Especially this last part. Like, you can be in the red here before this, but people are gonna crash this. For sure. So, I'm just gonna play that part safe. 46 in rounds. Wild time. Nani! Thank you for 49 months! Thank you so much. Welcome back. Merci beaucoup. Next deep dip, it's gonna be in uh, in November, as far as I know. So the pro players have the option of, do I want to practice World Cup right now, or do I want to play deep dip? Because <laughs> World Cup is also in November. <laughs> and I think what might actually happen is that people who stream deep dip will have more viewership than the Trekmania World Cup. As crazy as that sounds. I, uh, maybe with the exception of the finals. But they do, uh, they do clash, the two events. What is Deep Dip? It's like a... Getting over it type tower. Like, only up type map. Goal is to reach the top first. And it's a, it's a race. Whoever does it first is cool. Died early in Div 2. I don't have to play this while crashing. It's so, it's so intense. And I, I thought like this map would be a lot of space because Blade Runner maps tends to be, but 
Yeah, this is tight. Tight map. Will Deep Dip be bigger than last year? I think so. I don't know how, because they're hitting the map building limit. Like, the height limit of the, the stadium. But maybe there's ways around that. If not taller, then harder. Or maybe just... Oh, why am I drifting here? Or maybe just wider. It's like more content per floor. A bit of a brain freeze. Oh, Scrappy, plus four. Uh oh. It's not over though. People could still crash here. People could still crash here. Can he save it? People did crash, but not enough people. Loudest and Scrappy, actually. Top two quality. Both out. This is going to be one of those cups where, where the safest player wins. I'm telling you. I'm going to lean back. I'm going to drive my safe lines and I'm going to be chilling. There's no need to play a risky playstyle. Can't even make me go close to a corner. Oh, red? It doesn't matter. Look at this. Look at this. Massive release. Look at this. Massive release. Okay, that was actually a pretty good, good turn, but... Now close to the rock. I'm gonna go wide here. Gonna take this downhill smoothly. Oh, 34th. Just where I feel at home. A little bit wide here. That's okay. Now wide here. Big release. And then... Very cool. <laughs> Still beat about 10 people. Linchilla, thank you. Streamer, be careful, please. I am, I am. Don't worry about it. Has Hobbit won a couple today? Has he? Surely. Surely he has. Else, I... I, I don't think he would be trolling as many of them as he is. Good. What? <laughs> and then, yes. It's kind of crazy, right? Because like. Right now, it looks so crash-heavy. But to get into Division 1, the slowest player drove like 47, 68 or something. Like, everyone here can beat this time that I just drove. Everyone on the server. It's just such a hard map to drive consistently. But I think that was right around the cutoff, was like 0 .68, 0 .69. That's so slow. A lot of scary turns here. People have made big mistakes, I see. I think I'm gonna spend these rounds to get like a little bit more pace for for later. So like next round I wanna go for a bit of a faster start. There's one corner I always release in for safety. But I don't have to. Map looks better without the mod, yeah. As soon as I saw it, I, I disabled it. 
He always does this before he crashes. I know. But I, I, I do this because I want to win. For that, I need better starts. It's still released. Didn't dare to full speed the turn. Done. Okay. Point seven with some safe parts. Ban, think of the one year and tail laps, think of the prime. Well, now I can listen to this song again. Since we have split audio tracks. Okay. Do you have to kneel that last turn? You don't, but you, you can also just release acceleration and do like a. Release drift. It's probably what I would do if I wasn't kneeling. Neil makes it comfortable though. <laughs> Slowest start. I'm in the red. No? Not far from it. That was a very bad start. Yeah, now point 0.6 is starting to be slow. That's the thing, right? But I was like plus point 0.5 after a few checkpoints, and then I kept that gap to the finish. So, so it is the starts. Like, I can tell it's in the starts. It's just the riskiest part of the track. That one downhill. That one downhill. That's the part I'm talking about. Ooh. Very close round, okay. I wasn't sure if that was gonna work. I just gambled it, to be honest. <laughs> that was a full send? I just, okay, if this is me out, then it's me out. But it was perfect, perfect turn. A couple of very close turns there. Sometimes you get to the point, you just make a decision like, yeah, if this is me out, then that's okay. I think it's the timing, and it was. Meow, yes, I'm saying meow chat. Not me out. Okay, top 16 almost. Almost top 16. Two more. Oh wow. Oh god. It's trouble. Ah. Okay. Point two. <laughs> okay. Fifteenth. 
Too bad start. Point seven. I mean, not a bad run, but the start was too slow. So it it is what it is. I had a good end though. Had a good end. Top fifteen on speed tech. I'll take it. I'll take it. Believers win. That's what we like. So we like secure the believer W and then and then we dip. <laughs> Let's see who takes it. I saw someone drove a 46 there, was it? Is it Paul? I don't know. Oh people are doing this. Okay. Yeah, Ludus was oh my god. Look at the speed this saves. If you get this. Massive mistake. That's, that's like 0.5 in one turn that I lost that round. I went out. And now the nerves are kicking in. Oh god, the nerves. Uh, this run from Deska is still almost faster than what I drove. And he crashed. Release? Wait, they released last turn? No, it's slower. Okay. Maybe that's better. It's hard to say. Decent overall tippy, thank you so much for like, gifting a sub. And Christian, thank you for the prime. They do release, okay. Yeah, then I'm missing some strats too. There's like one and a half things I was missing. But with how much time as well, like in the qualifier, I spent like eight minutes just being, is this a release or a drift? Is this a release or a drift? And I still had the wrong answer at the end of it. Ooh, spam. Eine echte lecker. Uh, Rasing linea. Schneller, schneller Kopf. Die uh, Motor, a Motorbahn. <laughs> I don't know how to speak Dutch. It's a funny language. Murray and Baron died. This was fast. Point, yeah, point 0.4 and you're out. Yeah, I would have to PB. I think I could do point 0.2 here. Point 0.2 in a speedy round, I could. But consistently, not at all, so... Is where the tech and these are gonna shine. The thing you have to hit consistently here is this downhill. This approach. Boom. And look at the speed. He's the basically the only one to get it with 12th. I got it. And they're a tenth ahead. I lost a bit of speed there though, so he's getting caught up too, but. People are risking this one. Jaka and Ender both risked it, and they're now like four seconds behind, right? So that is, that is what you run into. They essentially have to dare to almost full speed it to be in. Yeah, but... Mm. I think drift goes about equal there. If only, if, if only equal. I think it does. Philip, thank you for the prime. Ida Gaming and uh, Trail. Mix Connoisseur, thank you for the prime. Freestyle TV, thank you. Where does Scrappy on? 46, I think. But I think he crashed that exact turn combo. Uh, it's really hard to recover if you do, even in early rounds. You can release there and lose like a second, but if you crash, it's like plus three. And then it's just so hard. So once again, boom. Oh my God, I thought Yonix would release, he dared. And he will get the rewards for daring. Link's gonna need a crazy ending. He's gonna- oh wait! He has two opponents, that's a lot better than one. One of Ozion or Yonex could make a mistake. It's full sense already here and he's caught up to Yonex. Now this, does he dare to full speed? Small- oh, big release. Yonex could capitalize on it. Just about equal. Oh my god, Yonex with the speed! Ah! The landing! Flies too far. 
Very nice battle. They're both contenders to win. Like, they were driving fast, both of them, so... Big knockout there. But really stacked. I think the players that have gone under the radar right now are like... Ike Wolf and Down. They've just been hiding in the middle, about always. Ooh. See Ike. I was in a Division 2 against Ike Wolf yesterday. Or was it two days ago? Super weird map and we both got Div 2 spam released by the way, last place. No need to panic. But he needs a good run from here on out. Link is out. Dommage. C'est incroyable dommage, mec. Wait, did someone crash? No. 47-47. From the others. It's a big ask. That is a big ask. Alright, let me play this now. Wait, wait. Is it not? Oh, it's Ryder. Oh, this one. Wait, what you I just realized you can listen to stupid streamer without issues now because of split audio poggies. I can, but I can also listen to this. Couple of the day top six. Here we go. Paul in last. Oh, Azion with the biggest release has to back out of the turn. Point two. Catch up to Ike. Ike with low speed. That's going to be about a tenth. Better downhill for Ike. Extending ahead. Azion needs a good end from here on out. Good turn, though. Really good speed into this. Now he needs to carry it. Needs to use that for something. He's going to jump. Oh. Last turn. More speed! Full sand! No! I respect the attempt. What an effort. What an effort. I respect the attempt, but... Holy shit. <laughs> Top five. He saw the splits, was like, yeah. I gotta go. It's time to go for it. Paul with the worst start, but it decides here. Oh, they all got it. That's really sick. Wait. Almost all got it. Down with a crash. Unfortunate for down. A rainbow and Katsu, thank you guys. We will await the next round. Almost a year, Pog BTW. Are you considering merch at all? I think merch would be fun. Just gotta find the find the right design and the right time as well to make it. But it would be fun. I think out of the four here, I'm rooting for Paul because I think he is the player that hasn't won in the longest time. If that makes sense. Like they've all won couple the day before, but I think Paul. It's been a while since his last. So, um, it'll be fun. Fun for Paul. Again with the worst start, but I think he's just trying to get a really good setup here. Comfort on- th Oh, has to back out! Oh, almost. Gets it better than Ike. Twelfth wide there. Ooh, had to release two. Lost a lot of speed all of a sudden. Ike or Paul, uh, uh, Ike or 12th, I believe, going out here. The others are far ahead. 12th's gonna try to do what Azion did. Last turn, full sand, more speed. Two hundredths. 
two hundredths. Paul with a 91. Despite the uh, iffy start. It's very impressive. How well did I play? He's got 15th. So I'm pretty happy with that. Is it going to be spam? Maybe it is spam. 2012 world champion on this track style. Put some respect on this man's name. There's probably people in chat that weren't even born yet when he was world champion of this game. <laughs> like the stats of that, there's gonna it's it's almost it's almost a certainty. He's been a world champion longer ago than you were some of you were born. Equal round. Oh my god, they're all equal on last checkpoint. Spam last though, spam with more speed than Ike, perhaps, perhaps, but not quite. Good round. Four hundredths between the three players. My god. It's wild. I'm glad I'm not still in this cup, because I, I would not like being a player and getting eliminated with that margin. It's Ike versus Paul in the final. Ike with better speed, but tougher turn, tougher setup is the main thing. Like this turn here? Oh, he hits it better though, Paul with the release. Making sure he doesn't crash, but at the cost of about a tenth of a second. Wider setup here, but maybe more speed on the no slide. Doesn't look like it. Two tenths the gap. Is the downhill any better? Smile. Slightly, slightly better for Paul. Catching up, 0.15. Equal drift, look at that. Exact same trajectory. Last turns. Eichwolf. So Okay, the DNF! And it will be Ike. Fending off Azion, fending off Spam, all these close rounds, he barely... ...stayed in, and he takes the win, GG's! GG, well played. Even a PB for him? That's, uh, that's just sweetening, sweetening the victory. Very nice. Yeah, my point five wasn't very competitive. I'm telling you guys, I could do a point two. I really could. I just couldn't do it in rounds. Dexter has a point thirty nine. I could definitely do a forty seven two. How do you have a forty six thirty nine here? What is that? It's just in rounds. I never dared to full speed this corner, and then when I tried, I had to release so much. That that was my problem. So I was just scared to full speed here. But we're soon going back to um, Trackmania Reverse chat. Map 21 Reverse, like a big puzzle I'm trying to solve. And then, at 10 today, I'm playing Chess versus Saikuno. Oh, I might have to drift there. Uh, that's the plan for today. You might be saying, why are you playing Chess versus Saikuno? Uh, it's because we're both in a chess tournament Hello called there. Pog Champs. Uh, and the winner of this goes to the semi-finals of the consolation bracket. And the winner of the semi this goes to play an in-person final in Los Angeles in a few weeks. So uh, I could I could still make a looser bracket run effectively and go to LA and play chess over the board in the consolation bracket final of Pog Champs. But it's going to require winning today. It's going to require a victory. I only have one decent one here. Just no this stun lock, just one good one. Dude. Well, kid, you better win their next D. Not a kid. I'm, I'm, I'm like. What am I? What am I? E-boy? <laughs> More accurate term. Cole Callaway, thank you. Anton, thank you as well. I will win. No beard equals kid. But see, the problem is, if I get a beard, I don't look like an adult. I look like a predator. And that's not an upgrade. 
That... That's the problem. Like, it, it doesn't <laughs> work. It doesn't work. My, my genetics are not meant for having a beard. Okay, nice. Copium timer. Just want to see. It's the first time I released this turn, all right? I usually drift. That was an 3 That counts, right? Guys, I drove a 3 You're right. I couldn't do a point 0.2. I could do a 3 That counts. That counts. I'll carry this it in 21 is, months. Dude. Hey, no, it doesn't. All right, I'll do it hope again. Hope you have a great day. And good luck for the chess match. You got this less than three. Actually, I'm going to do I'm going to do 46. <laughs> This is how a stun lock starts. But I, I'm not gonna stun lock. Just one run. What does Dexter do? Yeah, I have no clue. Point three is kind of wild. I think I understand some of it, but it's just a full sun run. More than anything else. Oh. This guy's Sigma is... Dude. Second place div 44. Joe. That's still pretty good. Unlucky you lost the finals, but well played. You beat a lot of other people. Ah. My mom taught me a valuable lesson when I was a kid. Uh, where she said that when you look at a scoreboard, Instead of looking at all the people ahead of you, you should look at who you are ahead of. Like, all the other kids on the scoreboard that you beat. So, like, instead of being sad that, like, three people beat you, you should think, I beat 22 people today, or whatever. You know? I was like, damn, thanks, Mom. That makes sense. I'm not the worst. Is that a point two? <laughs> okay, I'll take the point two. <laughs> All right, let's go back. I want to improve, but I'm not getting stunlocked. See, I'm learning. I'm improving. Zebra, Vesta Raider, Poisiny, thank you so much. Watch world record. <sighs> okay. I, was, I want to get started. Once okay, upon sure. a time, there was an old mother pig <laughs> who had three little pigs and not enough food to feed them. So when they were old enough, she sent them out into the world to seek their fortune. One second, it's just me typing. The first little pig was very lazy. He didn't want to work at all and he built his house out of Small straw. Typo. The second little pug worked yeah, okay. harder but he was yeah. somewhat lazy too and he built his house out of sticks. Then, they sand and danced and played together the rest of the day. Sand and danced? You got it wrong. Typo. Not valid. Okay, so he does do the jump. I said this was faster. I stand by it. Oh, Dexter. Oh, the speed. How? He almost got the correct speed slide overlap too, like the ideal. While thinking about everything else. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not going for track of the day world actually, actually. Okay. We're going for 21 reversed.